Welcome back, everyone. Now, for those of you who have just joined us, we're celebrating the 100th anniversary of Valeo. Don't hesitate to react and comment if you have questions for us. We'd love to hear from you. We've just travelled back in time through Valeo's prestigious and fascinating past. Now, let's jump to the present and have a look at what the future holds. And for this, we're welcoming Agnes Park, Valeo's HR Director, and Geoffrey Bucco, Group CTO. Agnes, Geoffrey, lovely to have you both here. Thanks for joining us. Thank you very Hi, much. Thank you. Well, in light of all the nostalgia, having journeyed through the highlights of Valeo's history, how does it feel to be the heirs of that history today? It just sounds like such a fascinating and really promising future for mobility. I want all of these things on my car. We're well, working on it. <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, I'd love to know, what did you both decide to bring with you today to symbolise the last century of Valeo? I know it's tricky to do that in one object. Agnes, let's start with you. So actually, I chose this photo. Yeah. It really is such an inspiring challenge that's facing Valeo, but the industry as well, to create the mobility of tomorrow. Thank you both. Thank you. I find that this great ambition for the mobility of tomorrow is actually most visible in Valeo's brand new, never before seen corporate film, which we now have the pleasure to premiere. Let's have a look, shall we? Valeo is 100 years old this year. It is a monument of automotive history that we have just celebrated together. And seeing the group's unique position today at the heart of transformations in mobility and where it aims to go, there is no doubt that the next 100 years will be just as rich and exciting as the past century. Thanks again to all of you for following us.